suckers. I got Braden Price's whole garage to myself right now. I already rode that thing. I guess like two of those ones are broken. This is his editor's Miller, and one of them is his mom's bike. I don't know, I'll take that one. Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls of all ages, can't 3D machines do a wheelie? Hey, don't be stealing my vlog. Let's see it. Woo, look at you go. Oh, yes, sir. There you go. Woo -hoo. All right, somebody's got to take this. I'm going to kill myself. <laughs> you got to get one, son. For sure. No doubt I'll about it. this on the back of my trailer. <laughs> Okay. No, oh, yeah, the night when I was leaving. Oh my goodness. What? <laughs> Easy. Nice. Don't scratch the paint. Look at this. Grab me my helmet and GoPro. Grab me my helmet. Oh. I like how you always wear a helmet. Grab my I helmet. Just, yeah. I don't get any protection. Do you want a helmet? I think I might for this. I mean, look at this. He, we cut the, the... You have a sharp thing there. You have a window in front of you that's no longer supported. That could literally blow up and fall on your face. He did this right in his driveway. Right in his driveway. Yeah. Uh, Freaking crazy. What do your neighbors think of you? My neighbors hate me. Do they? We have the best looking convertible in the state right now. So what do you think about the new convertible mod? It's, it's a wonderful thing. It only it took us about off six minutes. Sharp. It died. Did it? No. Come on, baby. You got it. We killed it. Dang it. What's that noise? Windshield wipers. Oh, the windshield wipers. 2000 Geo Metro with the orange accents, 130,000 miles. He's prime time, ready to rock and roll. We're gonna take this down to the. Oh, never mind. Okay. Buddy, you only have a portion of the car. I guess I hooked it up to the wrong thing. I hooked it up to the wrong thing. I told you to hook up. Yeah, hook but, 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 now, but now we have more airflow, so yeah. who's really doing who the favor? Giving it more airflow was a. Definitely a success. I have been called a genius before. I've also been called other bad. Yeah, yeah, I can see that. You can't have anything nice with this kid. You can't. Like, we get the car running after he takes it down the road, whips it down the road, five minutes later he's got it in a pond. Don't ruin your kicks, bro. I have to admit, I do like the way this helmet makes me feel. I can't believe he's, it's still running. Oh, you got my head all muddy, dang it, and filled with glass. Great. You're driving. Oh, yeah. That thing pulled it right out. Yeah, dude. That's impressive. Go. That's oh, really that's impressive. So we got to hit it with more speed. I think if I were to take over, I can get it through. I'm going to challenge you. I think I can make it all the way through. <laughs> Oh my god. Need the safety shades, boys and girls. Safety shades going on, dude. Alright, so what's your plan for attack? We're gonna treat this car phenomenally. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not satisfied with that scent. It's <laughs> not a last scent. Yeah, that was not. Y'all made it like almost there though. Oh, she's back wow. to life. Oh boy. What was that? Well, he broke the freaking windshield. I'm sorry, I disappointed you guys. I thought I was gonna have it. I know, I didn't make it because um, I have excuses and it's that's not a good thing to have, but I didn't see the cameraman and I let off because I didn't want to, you know, 
there's no windshield wipers. So I didn't want to like fly through this thing and hit the cameraman. So I'd rather be safe than sorry. It's too bad 3D Machines is responsible. I can't believe that thing still runs. That thing was running in the water. <laughs> we're, we're stuck. Again. This time not in puddle. No, get out and push real quick. Okay. so bad. Right. Best zero to 60 is right at five seconds for me, but that's quick. Yeah. It's a lot of truck to move like, that quick. Yeah, 8,000 pounds. So Brain was trying to show me his truck and how it like pulls like crazy. And it does pull like crazy. And unfortunately, Braden's neighbor kind of found it irritating. Now, Braden's neighbor is a cop. We don't disrespect cops. We understand that no matter what your profession is, you can have a bad day. And unfortunately, this guy was having a bad day. So he came over to Braden's house and had a little bit of a talk with us. Now, the audio isn't the best, but the, the whole concept is, is YouTube likes cops, everybody likes you know the adrenaline that you get from a cop interaction, and that's why we included it in this video. Okay, what we're doing is, he's a friend coming down from New York. I wanted to show him how fast my truck was. I stopped in the road, did a pull. The tires broke loose. I didn't try to do a burnout. I was actually trying to keep them from not spinning because they're damn expensive. But no, I'm not out here being reckless and causing a disturbance all the time. I, I did it once. I mean, that's what I do for a living. I understand. You know I mean, this is what I, I do for a living. I don't bother people up down this road. Have you seen me patrol up and down this road? No, no, I've always thought you've been a great neighbor. Look, sir, it, will, it won't happen again, but I can't promise you the other guys won't. I, you've all, you have been a good neighbor. You haven't had a problem with us riding four wheelers around here or nothing. I have never bothered you, have I? You have, I understand. But look, it just won't happen again. There's no, no Listen, reason to get so mad about it. It's all right. I don't hold happen. you responsible for other people's actions. Right. I can't do that. That's not right. That's not That's not right to hold you responsible for others. You're only responsible for your actions. Trust me, I've heard the Mustang that. plenty and of times. I time. understand that, and that's why I'm saying. And I've told uh, uh, Julius uh -huh. with the other one. Yeah. I mean, he he stopped. He, right I know he's bad with it. I hear him every every day. Every I mean, day. and and I guess it. You know, it, what, what perturbed me a little bit more. I'm gonna be honest with you. Was it Price? Yeah. Was Price? Is this when I just went and told him, mm -hmm. and I feel like, and then there's another one doing. It. You see what I'm saying? Yeah. It, it, are you tracking with me on that? Though? I understand. Are you tracking with me on that at all? I mean, that like. Yeah. Where it agitated me a little more, like when you warn somebody of it, and then and I know you're young. How old are you? Yeah. And this is the honest truth. Don't think I wasn't young. Don't think you know people don't do certain things. But at the same hand, I guess I am perturbed a little bit. I agree with Mr. Price that um, when they were doing it pretty bad. I mean, you and you, you know yourself. I, I it. don't have to tell you anything. They were burning them bad down out here. You know, I'm, and, and, and you know that. I don't have to tell you that either. I've seen y'all ride four wheels on the road. Yeah. Have I ever bothered you with it? No, and I appreciate it. I really yeah, do. I mean, ha I, and have I ever called the law on you? No. Again, I appreciate it. No. As long as you're not acting a fool on the road, mm -hmm. and I mean acting a fool, I'm talking about doing wheelies all the way around. Mm -hmm. But at the same time, I look at sometimes when you wreck that fool on the road, and mm -hmm. I come out here, then you're gonna say, well. I sort of deserve what's coming yeah. to me unless you ain't hurt. You know, I don't want to see anybody get hurt. Yeah. But I, I'm not that person. Oh, there they are. They're on yeah. the four wheelers. Boom, I got I you. <laughs> it ain't like that. 
I said, the blue truck is never your problem. And then I saw you night. I'm out there with my friends, and I know you saw me. I was in there. I honestly didn't even see Okay, it. well, that's what, I mean, I'm in the middle of my driveway, and you literally stopped, and like you said, you did spin your tires, and uh -huh. it is against the law. So that is careless and reckless driving. Uh -huh. I'm not right to take it. I don't uh -huh. want, I'm not out here trying to get uh -huh. full points in your license. Yeah. That's not, that, that, that ain't what I'm doing. Yeah. That, and that's why I told you this, too. I'm not out here trying to give people tickets. That's not, I don't get an enjoyment out of you getting going to court. So I believe everything was taken care of in a respectable manner. We don't have to worry about anything. They get along with their neighbors. Just as long as everybody gets along with their neighbors, no matter what the profession or anything is, we had to include that on the YouTube video. I hope you guys stay froggy fresh, stay super fly. If you haven't already subscribed to Braden Price, go down to the link in the description. I've had an awesome time with him this week, and we're gonna probably get some more content out to you. So make sure to subscribe. Until next time, Three machines and Braden's not here, but he's out too. We'll see you later.